I am back with a brand new and exciting video. I do say that at the beginning of every every video. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm trying trying to set myself up for the video by saying it's exciting. Well, it's exciting for me. I hope it is for you too, guys. So today is a haul. I know I haven't really done a haul on this channel for a really long while, obvious, you know, for obvious reason, because I'm in the process of moving. The last thing I need to do is buying stuff. I'm actually getting rid of stuff and things like that. But there are certain things that I've just kind of like been eyeing and I thought it was right now was kind of like the perfect time to get them. The shirt dress that I'm wearing is actually part of this haul and also this belt. I don't think I've ever got a chance to show you guys this belt in a haul. I bought this belt last month when I was looking for the perfect kind of like, you know, 10 belt to wear with all my dresses. And I wanted the Loewe one. Come to find out, Loewe is perhaps my favorite designer at the moment. I truly love their aesthetic, you know, very minimal, very chic. It's just everything that I love. And this dress, I actually just received it, just got delivered this morning at 9.30 or 10 o'clock. Um, this is from H&M. I have this dress in a linen material, which I bought at the mall in Bocara Town when I was in Florida a few weeks, um, two months ago, or a few months ago, I should say, I think back in April. My cousin has it, and I made her, you know, take me there so I can buy it um so i'm very very happy with that so i thought that one i could perhaps wear during the day because it's linen it's chic you know it's wrinkly love that and then when i saw h&m has this and this is kind of like a cotton material i feel like this one would be perfect this one looks a little bit more dressy because of the cotton material so i thought i would get this one and for the price you really can't go wrong with h&m to be quite honest i know it's not the most ethical place to shop at but um there are certain pieces that i absolutely love from them and i just feel like you know they've gotten a lot better over the last couple of years and i'm very very happy i got a size small um which some i don't know i'm thinking i should go in a medium because i wanted it to be a little bit more oversized but honestly this one fits me perfectly you will see it on the side of the screen here and let's go ahead and talk about my jewelry this is a pearl choker that i actually just bought from etsy it just came a couple of days actually it came on saturday because i wanted to do kind of like layered um pearl look and then this one is from monica Venator. i do have a coupon code for monica Venator. i actually have to contact them about my coupon because it's really hard to put on the screen but i will leave it in below where you can just copy and paste it into your order let's go ahead and get into this video obviously the first look is this look and um well let's start with the belt this is the belt that i got from Loewe. you guys know i've been looking for this belt all over and i couldn't find it in my size now all the sizes are back in stock on my Teresa. i will leave a link below for you guys to check it out if you would like to i couldn't find my size this is a size 80 and i was looking for either 75 or 70 um, and honestly, I think the 70 I think I was looking for a 75, but I think the 70 would have fit me just fine so I went to the store and then they had the 80 so I you know put it around my waist and I'm like eh, it's too big Disappointed, but I asked them if they can actually add additional holes in there because it comes with three holes Naturally, so they said they could it's six dollars to add the extra two holes So I just paid the 12 bucks you leave it there for a week and then they call you to pick it up and um that's exactly what i did when i couldn't find my size but now all the sizes are back and i'm still gonna keep this one um although i can size down if i wanted to but i like this i'll just keep this i don't need um because i don't like my belt any any more um tighter anyways you guys know i'm not a fan of tight things and the next thing i should start with um i've already done an unboxing for these items but i thought that i would still feature them in this video if you know some of you did not because i know some people that watch my unboxing you know don't watch my you know hauls and vice versa so it's from loewe i ordered a new basket bag because i tend to wear a lot of white and sometimes i just in situation where i feel like the white loewe basket bag looks a little bit more dressy than my 10 one the 10 one i feel like it's super cash it goes with everything as you can see it's just like perfect with this but i just felt like i needed the white especially for my style which is kind of like casual chic or kind of like very french chic 
and stuff like that and you know like the basket bag it's like really really big so i got the loewe basket bag in the natural white and i absolutely love it i've just been wearing this every day as you can see it just goes perfectly with my look right now oh god like this is one of my favorite looks in a really really long time and i feel like even with the tin belt it just goes perfectly so now actually i may look into buying a white belt but i think i prefer the brown because the, it will be too much white and white together so i feel just kind of like breaking it off even with like a black belt honestly i just feel like it would be a cute look so i got the slurvy basket bag because again my style is kind of like that style where i'm like very casual chic i just love to pop over i wear this from spring until fall time so three seasons out of the year winter is the only time but even then i still wear this in the winter time especially now since i may be moving somewhere tropical i think i've decided that i no longer want to live somewhere that has crazy winter i feel like i want to be in summer mode all the time the next thing that i will be showing you again although i've already did an unboxing I thought that I would um, include this. This is the Loewe puzzle bag. I've wanted the puzzle bag since it came on the market years ago. I believe maybe four or five years now. And at the time I wanted it in the tan color or which brown, whatever you like to call it. And I'm so happy I kind of like waited until now because my style had changed because back in the day I used to only wear neutrals. Honestly, I still wear neutrals. I do wear a little bit of color here and there, but most of my closet is just white dresses so my, most of my closet is still neutral but because of that and yellow is my favorite color color so i thought you know what i want a color i wanted this bag in a color that has that is kind of like pop and which makes a difference with kind of like my printed dresses because i have some printed dresses most of my printed dresses have some type of yellow in them and i thought you know what this one would be the perfect color and this is a khaki color over here and then you have the yellow on the side and then you have this kind of like two taupe color over here it's still a neutral in my eyes just absolutely stunning i love this bag so much there you go so you can see the true color and this bag it's meant to be worn five ways or something like that you can wear it as a backpack you can wear it as a top handle you can wear it as a crossbody and you can wear it over your shoulders um i don't remember the other way and then the cool thing about this bag is that because of the puzzle it is meant so where you can if you're traveling this bag turns into nothing and then you can pack it into which is something that i failed to mention in my unboxing so the way of the puzzles lined up i don't remember how you do that i'm gonna look up the video but yeah you can literally pack this so easily because of the way it's created that way um for that reason where it becomes nothing like this it becomes now flat. let's move on another one from h&m other swimsuit so i went looking for some white swimsuit because it's always a struggle for me to find some sweet suit i do have some ones that i bought from hansa g that i got on farfetch and i wanted to get some uh, bottoms that were high waisted like i said especially now if i'm going to be moving somewhere tropical i'm going to be needing some basic bathing suit and i don't really have any two-piece and for me personally when i go for two-piece um a high waist one is better for me and also because i have short legs also a uh, high waist looks better on me because i have a kind of like a good size torso i would say so this will just look more so much better and then also i don't really like to show my midsection so this kind of like covers that it's just perfect so they kind of imitate the hunza g material which is kind of like that crinkly material and then i was looking for a little top to go along with it and then i saw they had this this is a size small by the way i took a chance and ordered the top that looked kind of like a cute little kind of like top but it's like a, a swimsuit top but this is for the ladies and myself so i took a chance by ordering this i'm like if it doesn't work out i'll just return it and i ordered the size us6 and omg guys when i put this one what you will see on the side of the screen the support that i got from this i was so impressed and i'm so so happy that i got a size 6 on this and i i'm just obsessed with this so i cannot wait to just wear this bathing suit i also got another um white bottoms again high waist 
Um, this is a US 4. It fits me perfectly. And this one is kind of like strappy, which you can't really see because it's white strap. But I absolutely love them. And then I can kind of like miss and match if I want to. You guys saw that I went to air in the Hamptons. And I got to pick out two outfits from them, which was very kind of them. And you guys were like... All of you in the comments were like, did you get the denim and the shirt? I'm like, come on guys, you know I did. Like, what question is that? You know I absolutely did. As soon as I walked in, I saw the look on Gigi. I'm one of the girls at the store. I'm like, I need this exact look. Like, I, I need this. It's just perfect. You guys know I don't really wear denim. But here and there, I would love to have a nice pair of denim that fits me. And I have yet to find that. So I finally, I think I finally found that perfect pair of denim for me. And the shirt, this is 100% cotton. Most of my shirts are linen. Again, I wanted a nice shirt with um, that was cotton, which gives it a little more of a dressy look. I absolutely love this look so much. It definitely was my favorite look there. Like, OMG, and I got a size small. Now, let me show you the denim. This is called, I believe, the Yes Yes Denim. I will leave the link below so you guys can check it out. I'm a size 24, but um, I would say it was a little bit too tight for my liking. Yeah, it's called a Yes Yes. That's the name of the style. And I got a 25. I love the 25 so much better because I feel like once I start wearing it, it's going to loosen a little bit, which I love. Again, I don't have anything in this wash. I mean, obviously, I don't really have any denim at all. Oh, the only other one that I have is the one from End of the Stories. Yes, I still have that one, which I wear um, on the times where I need to wear denim. The wash is a wash that I was kind of like looking for. It has a little bit of a gradient, kind of like more white on the knee area. And then you have the rest blue. But yeah, I am very impressed by how comfortable this felt on me and looked on. It, it was just so, so great. So yeah, I am obsessed um, with this denim and the shirt can't wait to try it for you guys so you can see and then the next look that i picked out of course was a dress is this blue strap dress i don't have anything like this and i've been looking for something like this forever i got the extra small and it fits perfectly it has two tie in the back but i believe you can put it around in the front if you really want to so maybe i'll show you how it looks in the front and how it looks in the back especially since i just got this kind of like blue strap headband from bell fix this together would just look so so cute if you want more of a kind of like girly vibes and if you want more of kind of like beachy vibes you can pair this with a hat i plan on wearing this with like a hat whether it's white or any type of a hat oh plus i can wear my hat with the blue ribbon Ooh. but yeah this is um i believe this is linen i believe this is 100 percent linen and it has pocket as well this doesn't have any lining because it's thick enough where you're not going to see your undergarments but i don't mind a little bit of you know like show but yeah i absolutely love this so you guys know i sold my um sleeper dresses both of them the rose printed one and the navy blue um i did not even advertise them people just reach out to me they like they wanted to buy them and i was like mm, why not because i had got them in a size small and i felt like the size was a little bit too snug on me i didn't like the way it fit especially sometimes when i'm going up the stairs and then my feet will get cut up because it wasn't enough space around it so i just and then also for the bus area i just felt like it was a little bit too much and i wanted more uh, fabric in that area so I was so happy actually to just sell them as much as I love those dresses I was happy to sell them because the one that I truly wanted was the white so I decided to actually reorder the sleeper dress but this time in the white and also I got the medium this looks so dreamy guys I absolutely love it you guys know how the sleeper dress is there's just like the hottest thing right now people don't really sell them and if you do find them online people want like a thousand dollars for them like one of the ones that I saw they're like these are dresses that you can actually wear um they can be your house dress you can wear them to bed and you can also wear them out this is perfect for the beach picnic for a beautiful day kind of like um shopping around um this will look beautiful in a pizza italy or mexico love some prints here and there i still wear printed dresses but um it's not a lot most of my wardrobe is white because this is what i feel the most confident in the most myself in and that's that 
then stard i know i got rid of a lot of my stard um dresses or pieces should i say i did sell quite a few bags because i wasn't really i wore them when i wanted to wear them and i wasn't really wearing them as much or reaching for them and then also i didn't want to take as too many things with me so if you guys wanted to kind of like enjoy or get something that you missed out on i wanted to give you the opportunity to buy it but I, as soon as I saw this dress when it came out, I just knew I was going to have it, honestly, as soon as I saw it. I don't really wear um, kind of like sleeveless things, but this one, yeah, this one doesn't have sleeves or sleeveless thing often because the sleeves are typically too thin. They don't cover my bra strap. This is the kind of bra strap that I, that I wear. It's still super skinny. This is the skinniest bra strap that I've been able to find over the last year. So I'm very happy about that. But at the same time, I want a dress that have a thicker strap uh, when it doesn't have sleeve to kind of like cover this area. And then I kind of have like a third boob over there because my boobs are so big. They kind of like go into that area. So I kind of have a third boob, which is why I don't really like to wear kind of like strapless thing. And most of the time I kind of feel naked in strapless things really. So it's not because of these things. It's because I feel more comfortable when my arms are not showing. I, when I'm more covered, I actually feel more sexy when I'm covered than when I'm not covered. I don't know what that is, but... I prefer that i ordered a size small typically i'm a size four for start but i think you change your sizing everything is kind of like um letters now not numbers anymore which i don't mind so this is a small i feel like i could have gotten the extra small because this one is slightly loose but you know me i prefer loose things anyway so again i absolutely love this is because i got this because this was kind of like a dressy version of something that doesn't have sleeves so that's what I love about it. You guys know I'm obsessed with Hell House. They actually just a new collection came out. I almost ordered another one, but then I'm like, you know what, just stop. Um, you're ordering too many things and you need to be able to pack everything into suitcases. I ordered this, I've been wearing this. I, I'm so obsessed with this white dress. I've been wearing it like every day so much, um, which is this one. This is a nap dress. This is the Athena nap dress. And OMG, it's like the most gorgeous thing. Again, the reason why I got this is because of the sleeves and all the kind of like roughly detail. And they also have the smocking detail on the sleeve, which is just like so gorgeous, as you can see here. Um, and this is my house dress that I wear all the time. I do wear it out also. It depends on where I'm going. If I'm going to grab coffee or run some errands quickly, I will pop this on. Because I've been wearing it so much, I thought, you know what, you need this in a shorter version. Because on the days where I feel it's too hot out and I want to just wear something that's shorter but have sleeves. So I went and got this one. It's the same material. They call it something. But I must tell you, this dress is a little bit see-through. So if you don't like see-through things, maybe wear a slip underneath. But I don't. I just wear my regular underwear. You can wear flesh on. When you wear flesh on, you don't see anything. But typically I wear flesh tone, but because I don't have a lot of flesh tone underwear, I just wear black and black works better. Do not wear white because it's going to look ridiculous because the white is going to show. So I would say perhaps wear like some black thongs underneath this so that way it's not too obvious. But I wouldn't recommend you wear white. Um, number one is where to wear nude underwear or flesh tone, whatever is the same color as your skin tone. The next thing that I got are these um, pajamas. I wanted some lemon pajamas. I wanted to kind of like upgrade my pajamas. Although I have my sleeper pajamas, but they're like for show. They're not things like you can actually wear. I just create content in them. But I wanted to upgrade to really, really nice pajamas. And Print Fresh was kind enough. Both, actually, they're both lemon, but they're like different. I wanted a white and a colorful one. And this one, guys, is just so stunning. Look at this. It's just so pretty. It has a lemon. And I love that the lemon. It's not printed, but it's more kind of like sewn in. What do you call this again? I don't remember. I should know that because I miss interest. But I absolutely love this. It's just, I got a size small. I feel like the sizing may have changed a little bit because a size small used to be a little bit too small. I did get one where it was a little bit too snug. So I think they've upgraded the sizes, which I absolutely love. And I love that this has pockets. And let me show you the bottom. The thing I love about their pajamas, the bottom has pocket also. That was one of my favorite thing because I don't understand when places make pajamas without bottom. Like, where am I supposed to put my phone? Like, if I need to put something in my pocket, like, where is it supposed to go? Like, if I want to put my keys, like, if I'm on vacation 
and I'm just kind of like going around the complex or something, but I still want to close my door. Where am I supposed to put my keys? So I love that this has um, the pockets. Like I said, I think they've upgraded the sizes, which is so much better because last time I got a small, it was a little bit too snug. So um, I did this time and this looks so much better. It like gives you um, some wiggle room because the things you're sleeping in, you don't want them to be too tight, at least for me. And then of course I got a printed one because I wanted to inject some color in my wardrobe. Especially if I'm going to somewhere tropical, I want to have some really, really cute. Again, this is lemon printed as well because you guys know I'm obsessed with anything lemon printed. I just love it so much. And it's just so beautiful. Look at this. Oh, so stunning. Again, this is a size small. This is going to be so cute to sleep and also to even create some content with. And these are the bottoms. You have the thing over here. And then you have pockets also on the side. Like so many details. This is actually one of my favorite brands for pajamas. So if you're looking for um, kind of like holiday gifts um, to give your loved ones, I would say you can never go on with a pair of pajamas and I absolutely highly 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 recommend um, print fresh for you to check it out if you are someone who typically like to give their family pajamas kind of like every year this is the one that I would go for this is a yellow top that I got from Farfetch this is Saint Agni which is a new brand that I discovered in Farfetch never heard of them before but as soon as I saw this you guys know this kind of like top is my favorite you know that have this tie kind of like in the middle and this one has no buttons and then also it's cropped that's my thing i love this kind of like crop um shirts because they go so well with what i wear on the bottom because sometimes when the shirt is too long it just looks so weird on me so i need things because i'm not like a tall person i'm like five three i keep reminding you guys and then also i have a shirt similar to this that i wore into the ground i've had it for like seven years and at this point it's not even recognizable anymore i still have it because i just couldn't get rid of it yet until i find something that kind of like can replace it until i saw this one on farfetch i had to have this like this is just like so perfect and also i wanted to have it in this kind of like an off-white um this is kind of like a cream color and they happen to match my next purchase which is Zimmerman. You guys know I went to Zimmerman looking for these shorts. Looking for some other pink shorts, which I actually ordered. Um, because I want to create some more short looks, sort of like classy. And Zimmerman fits the bill because they just make the cutest classy shorts, in my opinion. And this kind of like match this so nicely. Look at this. It's just like, it looks like they were made for each other. Although Zimmerman have the matching top, plus it has the matching blouse. I did not like the matching blouse. It was cute, but um, the matching blouse, it came right over here. And I don't like things I cut right here. For people with a larger chest, when you go in for tops, you don't want a sleeves that stops right here. You want a sleeve that's three quarter or long because if it sits right here, it's, it's gonna be like right here. So it's going to put more emphasis on your chest. That works for no chest, not I only say no chest, it for people with smaller chests. That works well if you have kind of like a short sleeve. But for people like myself, it does not work. You want something that's three quarter, that's, you know, kind of like right here. So, um, yeah again i absolutely love these shorts again they're like a little bit overpriced for what they are but then again um nobody in the market i guess i haven't seen the replica for these yet i'm sure zara is actually working on them or some other companies but i haven't seen them yet and i don't really shop at zara anymore and for some pieces i don't like to buy the dupe i would rather buy the real thing and i wanted to have the real shorts for these because the detail are just like absolutely amazing like the scallop detail the print and then i feel like this can go really really well in the fall time as well because it's kind of like an amber color it's not like your typical yellow the next item is from chic wish i actually got a medium in both dresses and now i'm thinking i should get this small because they are quite big on me maybe i did lose some weight i don't know but again i could always build this so i went from i went for this kind of like yellowish color to kind of like deflect from all the white stuff that i have i wanted to have something that was more on the yellow color um this is kind of like a ankle length dress again i love the kind of like um lacy detail or bordery anglaise um if you call it that and i love the detail on the neckline over here it's just so beautiful i'm gonna 
put this on and then I'm gonna pop over the belt to see if it looks better with the belt I've only tried it without the belt and it looks it was a little bit too big for me but I love this dress it's kind of like very chic you can actually dress this um, dress you can actually dress up this you can do so many things in this dress I absolutely love it you can wear this to church wherever you like to go you can wear this and from anthropology I was looking for like a nice little dress where I can actually wear it out at night in the summertime and also I can wear it as a house dress if I need it when I saw this on anthropology I just had to have it it's so perfect what I love about this this is like the sexy detail that you don't really see um, yet but I feel like it's just such a cute detail to have because you can take it from day to night and it's short and flowy and flirty um i absolutely love this one it's just so so perfect it's not like a true black it's kind of like a reddish um uh, black i don't even know how to um to describe this color but yeah it's absolutely stunning and a skirt that i am obsessed with from Indo is this plaid skirt you guys know plaid is usually reserved for winter time when i saw the skirt i'm like oh plaid for summer yes you know count me in and this is when i started looking for black accessories because i wanted to style the skirt and i didn't really have anything i could have styled it with this yellow top it actually makes sense to to style with it because this has more yellow it's not white with this but i just think i just didn't want to do it but it would have been a good look actually with this top but i ended up styling it with a white shirt which i didn't really i liked it but i feel like it would have been styled better with this yellow one or the black would have taken it to the next level so now i'm on the hunt for some black accessories like a beautiful kind of like top or a black linen shirt and so on so i'll let you guys know when i find these but i absolutely love the skirt this is a size small from anthropology this is like a you know on a day where i don't want to wear a dress and i just want to wear like a cute little black top and i feel like this one will just like be perfect to just wear with that next dress is actually from ship wish again the same kind of like denty this is actually white i just love all the details um all kind of like the lacy it's not lace it's called something else um or embroidered detail whatever you like to call it i absolutely love all the detail on the neckline also the flow on the sleeves and then you just have some layers here this is a cute little dress again i got a medium in this but i feel like maybe a small would have fit me because it's a little bit big and we've got this blouse from anthropology the reason why i got from this blouse uh, went for this blouse is actually the waffle detail here because most of my blouse are kind of like very simple and i don't have anything that is formal but with some kind of like beautiful detailing and i love this one i believe this is linen actually i am going to style this blouse with the zimmerman shorts and then let's see what they look like i feel like this one will be cute i ordered actually a beautiful white blouse from dish which i'm still waiting for my order i know i've complained about this a million times already on here but yeah um i will try this with the with the with the zimmerman shorts and then you guys can see and when i went to the hamptons i was lucky enough to get a shirt from laura ashley and Mem shows and this is the part that i got this is a size three um this shirt is just so beautiful i don't have anything like this again this is still a neutral uh but then again look at all the detailing guys you have a pocket on this side this is one of the most beautiful shirts that i've ever seen and i think that this one would be so so cute this would go really really well with like a black um linen shorts and i also do feel that if i can find like a green short from one of the colors on here i could match it perfectly and also if i could find something that is kind of like a brownish short like do you understand how cute this will look i'm already um you know trying out all the look with this in my head from francis valentine i know pjs this is like a big deal this is a pj that i've always wanted to have also is to have a set it comes with this cute little bag sorry guys princess valentine i really really love the red things on the side to tighten it but this they actually were able to put my name on it which is so so cool i wanted to put that chic but then i was like eh, i'll put those in there 
but i absolutely love this guys what i really wanted is a pair of pajamas that were that have shorts and i finally found the perfect one and then this hot pink is just super like super duper cute i love it it's so so chic again i will link this below if you guys want to check this out now let's move on to accessories from accessories the next necklace that i got it's another one this one has this is a pearl choker also with the cuban leg chain again i wanted to do this layering which is why i got this but what happened is i had ordered this first not even looking at the other ones and then after ordering this i went back and then i saw this i was like i like this one actually better so and the next accessories or the one that from, from belfix i showed you guys this before i can wear this with my air dress it just looks so cute and i also have an h&m shirt in that same print and i'm thinking it's just gonna be so so nice and we have this one this is from the desert collection it's just some cute colors to kind of like wear with everything so i love love this one as well and then we've got this beautiful one i love the colors on this and this one is more kind of like a it's like a silky material and i love that on the inside it's printed as well so cute on the days where if it's super windy and also i want to just look so kind of like girly this is what i would go for and just put on headband i also got a draw clip i love this draw clips especially when i'm washing my natural hair and also when i sit outside but then again i want to have my hair up i typically always put it in a like draw clip because that just feels so good to me and then you can also style your hair with the draw clips you could probably um kind of like do a little um you could probably braid two of the sides and then you just add kind of like the draw clip i don't know how it looks on the back but kind of like, like this like this is such a cute look right i could do this i need to like style my hair more often i just don't have the time for it guys i just hate everything that has to do with kind of like styling hair doing hair it's not it's, it's not for me it's not for me but wow like this is so cute let me find out okay all right maybe i'll try i will be honest shoes is not something that i buy often i only buy shoes when i need them um to be quite honest i am not a shoe girl most girls are shoe girls but i am not crazy about shoes like that like me i'm okay with just buying one pair of shoes and just wearing it every day that's just me personally i am more of a dress or clothes person my dresses i love buying new dresses all the time but in terms of like shoes and bags that's not me but i've been looking for the perfect pair of kind of like white sandals with like a small heel i don't wear high heels anymore it's just not for me so i finally found the perfect white sandals for the summertime from express these are from express and they are worth every penny guys i got my regular size a six and they fit perfectly and then also this tie around your ankle and it was just like so perfect i absolutely absolutely love these i highly highly recommend them i've been wearing them every chance i get honestly every time i have to go to an event or to go to like a lunch or something these are the shoes that i go for because it was just so chic thank you again so much for watching guys so let me know what have you been buying this summer or what are you planning on buying are you checking anything out from what i've showed you Thank you again so much for watching. I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.